Hey everybody, Joe here with Canada the Movies. This time I'll be talking to you all about the Netflix series called The Gentleman. It's starring Theo James, Kaya Scodelario, Ruby Sear, and Daniel Ings, along with a host of others. Now, um, The Gentleman is a series on Netflix. It's a Netflix exclusive where Theo James plays a character named Eddie Halstead, who is our protagonist. And we get basically shoved right in off the bat where Eddie Halstead is a member of, I think, the uh, World Police. And he's doing his job. He's, you know, militarized, etc. cetera. Um, but then come to find out his father is passing away. Um, so that's the beginning of the story. Uh, Eddie Halstead, it comes from a line. He has a lineage where he is royal blood, but he's second in line for his estate. Um, but some things happen and he turns, it turns out that he becomes the estate holder and keeper. But it wasn't just simply him inheriting the estate. He inherits a whole lot more. Dun, 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 insert drama. It was really good. I, I think that the gentleman was really good. Um, it, it talks a lot about um, a lot of different things about how like the most gangster people were like the royals, you know? Um, and you kind of get to see that, you know? Not only with uh, Eddie, but his brother, Freddie, who is an idiot. Uh, for all for all intents and purposes, even the um, gatekeeper, the the lawn keeper, and all of that is in on it. There's a lot of crossing, double crossing, stupid ideas, and things that happen. I, I feel like you know Eddie was kind of built for, but Freddie was not. And uh, a lot of this has to do with Eddie belling Freddie out um, of a lot of issues, like. I don't know about you all, if you all have any like brothers or sisters that are kind of dumb, but it was one of them situations. Now I don't, you know, my sister's really, really smart, but, um, they, you know, Eddie ends up having to bail Freddie out of a lot of stuff. And while doing that ends up deep in some doo doo by himself, if you know what I mean. Um, so it also, um, stars uh, a person by the name of Kaya Scodelario who is who plays Susie Glass and Susie Glass is a very interesting character. I'm not going to tell you about who she is, what she is, why she is, and what her um, relationship is with Eddie Halstead because I feel like that would be a um, a giveaway to some of the plot, so I don't want to uh, ruin it for anybody because honestly I would say that I would uh, recommend this as a drama. Um, it, it has a good plot. It has a lot of good twists and turns. It has a lot of good fight scenes. Um, um, a lot of silly things that sometimes happen in there as well. Um, and it's just, it's a lot of fun to watch. Um, I actually think that it, this may be worth a watch or two. Um, and I'm looking forward to whatever the next season has, if they green light that. I hope that they do. So, for those of you who have not seen Gentlemen, the Gentlemen, let me know down in the comments below whether or not this review actually helped you to make the decision to watch it or not. Um, and if you have watched it, let me know what you thought down in the comments below. I think that the Gentlemen is an A. Um, as far as the season goes, I would recommend it to anybody who loves drama, all right? Uh, again, my name is Joe with Kenneth at the Movies. Please click that like, share, and subscribe, as well as hit that notification bell. And, you know, we will greatly appreciate it because we're almost at a 1,000 subscribers, and that will mean a lot to us. Y'all take care and have a fantastic day. Peace.